since I've gotten Baby Hawk R, I've only had 4S. And I just recently figured out the right pids for the 4S build. The problem is it does run a little hot. So no matter what I do, I lower those things, the, the D gains all the way down and it still runs hot. But I figured out the pits from the factory and it's just something that the Emacs team came up with for the three inch with 4S. So there's actually two PID rate profiles. And what I'll do is I'll put the CLI dump in the description. So you could just go copy that and then paste it directly into your CLI and you'll be able to get the 4S and 3S PIDs. And that's for the three inch, but they work pretty good for the 2.5. So I'd say, yeah, go ahead and try those and let me know what you think. It's the factory recommended PIDs for Baby Hawk R 3 inch. So I'm running these on the 2.5 and I've also got a 2 inch and I am having problems with it running really hot. The motors are running when they come in they're really hot. So I've lowered the D's all the way down and it still is running hot. So uh, I would recommend honestly going with 3S on the Baby Hawk just because these tiny motors are really not able to handle 4S as well as something like, I mean, if you compare that to like the XJB, so this is designed for 4S, and then you look at the motors, you know, I mean, that's, that's uh, the difference. These are 11L6s versus uh, 14L7s. So, I think the Baby Hawk's more of a 3S machine. It's going to do a little better. In fact, I have some 2S batteries, and the motors run really cool on 2S batteries. But it's just more of a mellow flyer with 2S. So anyway, look in the description. I'll put a link for the CLI. And you can just take that copy and paste it directly into your CLI and press enter. It has save as the last command, so it'll just turn it and reset it, basically. Turn it, uh, disconnect, and reset all the settings. All right, thanks for watching.